So, you've decided to get cataract surgery. What's next? Well, in order to prepare for your surgery, your ophthalmologist will take some measurements of your eye, a process known as biometry. This is a very important procedure to ensure that the power of your lens is appropriate for the size of your eye, so that your vision after surgery is as clear as it can be. The process is similar to making you a pair of pants. We need to measure your waist to ensure that the pants actually fit, not too tight or too loose. If you normally wear contact lenses, it is necessary for you to remove them for at least one week for soft contacts and at least three weeks for hard contacts. It's also important to let your ophthalmologist know if you've had refractive surgery, such as LASIK, PRK, or RK. There are two common ways your ophthalmologist may take your measurements. Either using the traditional ultrasound probe, known as ultrasound biometry, or the newer infrared laser, known as optical biometry. In traditional ultrasound biometry, your ophthalmologist will give you some anesthetic eye drops and then place a plastic shell, which is attached to the ultrasound probe, between your lids. The shell will be filled with a solution. The probe will send sound waves that will allow your ophthalmologist to measure the inner structures of your eye. When the procedure is done, the shell is taken out of your eye. In Ontario, ultrasound biometry has been used for many years and is fully covered by OHIP. However, the measurements taken may be less accurate than those taken with optical biometry. Optical biometry is a newer method that is not covered by OHIP but it provides measurements of the best possible accuracy. The procedure involves placing your chin on a chin rest and looking straight at a small target produced by a machine. This machine works by sending an infrared light wave that will travel through the inner structures of your eye and it will give your ophthalmologist the measurements needed for surgery. If you've had previous refractive surgery, optical biometry is highly recommended. Ultimately, ultrasound biometry is the traditional method that is covered by OHIP. Meanwhile, optical biometry is the newer method that gives you the best possible accuracy, but is not covered by OHIP. Biometry is an essential step to a successful surgery that will help you restore clear vision. So please don't hesitate to ask your ophthalmologist any questions you may have about the procedure.